Hey everybody, welcome back to Free Space. Uh, we got some comments here um, from 1988 Alex. Uh, thankfully I forgot about this. Yes, the asteroid mission is so infuriatingly tedious. I remember replaying it over and over again to get the above 50%. I never could. Yeah, probably because you stopped giving a shit. Because frankly that mission really, really is one in which you just stop giving a shit. I mean, that's a mission you want to get through and put it behind you and just say fuck it. I mean, seriously, that that's that one's not fun. Whoever put that fucking mission in the game needs to be taken out in the back lot and have the shit kicked out of him. All right, uh, and on to some guys. Uh, a rogue group inside a formerly hostile nation. You don't say. Looks like Free Space is seeing a lot of bugs. Well, it's a game from 1998 running on a modern operating system. On Windows 98, Windows 2000, or Windows XP, ran like a fucking dream. You started getting into the more modern operating systems, things get a little more problematic. All right, well, anyway, guys, thanks for your comments, and let's get on with this. Good morning, Yeah, we saw that. Initial attacks have gone off without a hitch. The Tyrannus is on her last leg. Delta and Epsilon wings have destroyed most of the Tyrannus' fighter escort. It is time to finish the job. To this end, Terran Command has sent a full wing of Athena bombers equipped with a newly developed stiletto bomb. The Athena is our most maneuverable bomber. It carries a massive payload, yet in dogfights, is nearly as effective as a fighter. Okay. The stiletto bomb has now been thoroughly tested back in Seoul and is now ready for use. It can be used to destroy subsystems on any ship and should prove more effective than the disruptor cannon. The electronic seeking device should make it simple to use. Just point and shoot. The Leto homing capabilities are limited, so make sure you get a clean shot before you launch. The stiletto should be especially useful in destroying the Tyrannus' engines and weapon systems. All Athena bombers will be equipped with stilettos and will be piloted by Alpha Wing. Yeah, we get the shit jobs. The Kane class cruiser Tyrannus has been chased from the Beta Cygni system back <coughs> to the IKEA system. Excuse me. It is low on supplies, and due to recent engagements, it is lightly guarded. Long-range sensors indicate that only two fighters and three bombers remain to protect the Tyrannus. Tyrannus is heading for the Beta Cygni subspace node, where it will probably resupply. This will allow for a small window of opportunity in which to conduct a strike. Your primary objective is to disable and disarm the Tyrannus in order to enable its capture. This will be our first attempt to capture a major Shivan vessel. Three wings will be assigned to this task. Alpha Wing will be flying Athena bombers. These bombers just arrived on the Galate and are equipped with a new stiletto bomb. The stiletto is capable of destroying subsystems in one hit. Alpha's primary responsibility will be to disarm and disable the Tyrannus. Beta Wing is assigned to escort Alpha and protect it from fighter attacks. Beta will fly Apollo-class fighters. Gamma Wing will fly Valkyries and should engage any hostile fighters and bombers in the area. If needed elsewhere, they can be assigned to any task that you see fit. Once the Tyrannus has been disarmed and disabled, <coughs> Omega Transports will arrive and capture it. When the Tyrannus has been captured, you are to return to the Galate for debriefing. Do not allow the Tyrannus to escape or be destroyed. Good luck. Yeah. Blow me. Beta Wing has arrived, awaiting orders. Gamma Wing has arrived, awaiting orders.
fail. Sir, the Tyrannus <coughs> is disabled. All right. Well, come on, someone, get the fucking thing off my ass. You fuckers do make yourselves useful. Well, I do with the fucking work here. Seriously, gonna have to help take care of fucking fighters because you fuckers aren't like of any use whatsoever. Where the hell is that bastard? Okay, there they are. useless piece of shit. How about that? How about you watch that? Whoa, shit, 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 shit. That's a, uh, that's a disabled enemy cruiser. Let's not run into that. Affirmative, it. sir. Attacking your target. <coughs> Alright. I'm pretty sure I did disarm the Tyrannus. I gotta shoot the individual weapons off of it? Hell, I don't know. Okay, so where's the gun turret? Okay, I'll have this Disarming here. target, sir. Sir, the Tyrannus is disarmed. The weapon subsystem was disabled, but whatever. Omega here on approach to Tyrannus. Support ship being deployed. 
get the fuck Attempting away to from attach me. to the Tyrannus. Rearming complete, sir. Attachment unsuccessful. Omega-2, give it a shot. Ah, here we go. Heads up, we have company! Shivan Wing Rama is attacking the Tyrannus. Stop them! Affirmative, sir. Fuck away from me. Fucking hate these people. Why are they all parking around me? Get that fuck away from me. Penetrating the hall will take some time. Stand by. <clears throat> yeah, and here we go. Heads up, we have company. Affirmative, sir. penetrate the damn thing, so they're gonna have to tell it. Enemy uh, wing just arrived! Runner. We not have all these fucking fighters here, because I mean, like, honestly, this gets a little bit on the tedious side. Affirmative, sir. Raider Hawkins here. Command said you needed some help. Hawkins, we'll need you to attach to that cruiser and tow it back to Tomba. Roger, moving into position now. Here we go again. Heads up, we have company! Affirmative, sir. I'm on it. I don't want to fucking fight I'm on these it. guys too much longer. No! 
Oh, one of my guys just died for some reason. Fuck me, run. Get out of my goddamn way. Who did we lose? Yeah, it was one of Alpha Wing. Die. There we go. Affirmative, sir. That has to be a bomber. Yeah. I will shoot you down if you don't get the fuck out of my goddamn way. Here, here, you want to be in my way? Here. You are firing on friendly targets, pilot. Yeah. They're fucking stupid. Darwinian, man. I'm helping the fucking species here. Heads up, we have company. <coughs> Docked. Give us some time to brace the attachment. Oh my god, dude. Well, if I can get rid of this cocksucker right here, then we can actually get somewhere. The so-called fucking wingman might also serve as a damn example, too, you know? Working on it, god damn it. They just won't stop coming. Enemy wing has just arrived. You Get out of my on fucking way. Pilots. Jesus Christ. I don't, I'm sure I didn't set the fuckers to follow me. Oh my God, enough of these people, man. Come on. Taking damage. Request cover. Jesus Christ. Even the fucking Sheevans are idiots. More jumping in. Heads up! We've got visitors! <coughs> well, I got a lot of kills, so I'm not exactly that fucking worried about it. guy needs to go. Lucky, what the hell was that? Affirmative, sir. You guys deal with the other fucking fighters. Enemy wing just arrived. 
god, dude. This is starting to get a little bit aggravating, though. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Affirmative, sir. I okay, have four counter, uh, 24 counter measures left. Yeah, taking losses is not doing me any favors. Yeah, it's the only mission I'm gonna have time for today. Fuck. This is the mission that just will not end, man. Taking damage. Request cover. Well, I'm working on it. Yeah. Oh, this playing this shit with a mouse is lousy. Not gonna lie, man. This is fucking lousy. I think if I do free space too, I'm gonna have to go buy a fucking joystick. Affirmative, sir. Mine, damn it. I'm out of missiles. Calling in a support ship. Oops. Enemy wing has just arrived. Jesus Christ, enough already. Jumping out now. See you at Tampa. So we'll finish these fuckers off and then jump away. I think that'll be enough for an episode. This is taking way too fucking long to get shit done. These missions are getting long. Affirmative, sir. Okay, dropping up countermeasures. Uh... Fucking Christ. I think it's pretty serious losses. My people took a little bit of a beating. And I'll admit, probably a good amount of that beating was from my own guns because I got a little bit pissed off and decided to give them a reason not to fucking stick so close to me and get in my way. But hey, I was trying to teach him a lesson, okay? Affirmative, sir. They drop the countermeasures and go full speed for a minute, and then we're gonna bring it about and shoot this piece of shit down. I mean, I don't think I have to fight these guys. I think I'm pretty much uh, good to go leave, leaving, but. Yes, sir. Leaving battle area. Uh, get on his ass, damn it. Ugh. Please be the last one. I'm tired of shooting you bastards down. Good enough for me. Let's get out of here.
19 kills. Huh. For having attained an outstanding number of confirmed kills, you are hereby awarded the ace. Congratulations, Alpha-1. You were instrumental in the first capture of a major Shivan vessel. The Halkins is taking her to the Tomba station, where engineers will be able to study their technology and learn more about their methods and motives. Meanwhile, feel free to relax for a few days. You deserve it. In recognition of your continuing service to the GTA, you have been awarded the Medal of Good Conduct. Great, so this means I can get totally fucking tanked and start hucking bottles at the other pilots in the hangar bay? Because that's pretty much what I would do. <laughs> hey, we're filling up some, uh, filling up our metal case here pretty good. All right. When the destroyers came for us, we attacked. Never had we been defeated. They were like the others, strange, hideous, resisting, fighting. Only these were not like the others. They did not die. We made our first retreat. We could forego one system. We left it to the destroyers and went elsewhere. But they followed. They hunted us. They followed us when we retreated, discovered where we lived. For a long time, we did not know why they chased us. They were no ordinary enemy. They did not seek our territory, our technology, our resources. Now we know our crime was sin. We've just received some discouraging news from Terran Command pilots. At 0300 today, after the captured Tyrannus was towed to Tombaugh installation in the Ribo system, the Sheevan staged a major ambush. There isn't a lot of confirmation from the footage yet, but it's clear that a Sheevan destroyer of massive proportions jumped in and destroyed Tombaugh station, along with all of its defenses. We have designated this new class of destroyer, Lucifer. Debris from the station is still falling from orbit on Ribos 4. And the Lucifer will be a pain in our collective ass for the rest of the game. Terran and Vasudan fighters and cruisers engaged the Lucifer, but were wiped out quickly. Footage suggests that the Lucifer was using a new type of shield, impervious to any of our attacks. Needless to say, this is grim news. If the Shivans indeed have managed to shield a vessel of that magnitude, it's merely a matter of time before they wipe out all frontline installations and march through to our home systems. Since all attempts at communication with the Shivans have ended in violence, it appears unlikely that a diplomatic solution will work. At this point, the Shivans have control of Beta Cygni, Betelgeuse, Ross-128, Ikea, and Regulus. Most of the Vasudan forces are gathering in Vega for a counter-strike, while we are gathering our fleet in Antares for an effort to retake Ribos and Beta Cygni. Oddly enough, the Shivans don't seem to be interested in taking control of any planets in the systems or gathering natural resources. Instead, they seem to be focused on controlling individual jump nodes. Research and development teams at Seoul have recently completed development on a few new weapons. A group of Terran scientists has returned from a previously unexplored system known as Alaramus and bring with them a new weapon called the Flail. The Flail is quite different from our typical energy cannons. Please consult the weapons database in the tech room for more details. Our communications with Vasudan technicians have yielded the interceptor missile. By combining the Vasudan designed engine with a Terran warhead, we were able to produce the most powerful anti-fighter weapon yet. It's an aspect seeking missile and requires a few seconds to lock onto the enemy's engine signature, but its speed and accuracy make it lethal. Use it well. All right, guys, that's a good spot to leave it. So, obviously, the situation is getting pretty fucking grim. So, you know. Hey, what do you expect? Anyway, guys, I will catch you next time.